<laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we will speak about the Halloween event and also about the Sky Mesh Pumpkin Hunt. We will make a review. You can collect a lot of pumpkins to earn hero blueprints, skill cards, gold and tokens as well. Well, the rewards and the contracts changed, you can earn much more as before, we will take a look later. In 2 vs 2 and 3 vs 3 fights, the rewards are increased from 12 to 16 pumpkins. The Skymish event. In the free reward line, you can earn up to 132 pumpkins. In the rip reward line, 264 and in total 396 pumpkins. I counted all the pumpkins you can earn together that you see what is possible. In the Blitz tournament, in the free reward line, 180 pumpkins. In the VIP reward line, 360. In total, 540. We have two Blitz tournaments, that means 1080 pumpkins in buff Blitz tournaments, what you can collect. And in the big tournament, the free reward line, 504 in VIP. 1008 and in total 1512 means very lot so in all events you can take 1988 pumpkins just from the reward lines so that's here nearly the half of the pumpkins you have to earn 6000 is the maximum and now we take a look on the contracts that i can show you that they are much higher as before the contracts changed and I can just say play the event it will help you to get your account stronger. Here we take a look on the reward lines from the Skymish and you can see you can earn a lot. This is the Blitz tournament zombie apocalypse and here you see the other reward lines. This is the tournament pumpkin madness and here we take also watch all the rewards you can get and at least the battle royale another blitz tournament now we go to the review for the skymish pumpkin hunt and we go into the battle well you start with your partner on an empty base you have a small squad and you can collect the containers what I can say, it's better to move with your army into the middle of the map because the first pumpkin will appear very fast. And when you play this tournament for a medal, we have here no tactic for a medal hunt, but here you can maybe think about it and learn something about the skymish. You have to be fast in the middle when you want to take a medal to take the first pumpkin as fast as possible. The pumpkins are coming um, on the middle between the two green bases. Okay, There is a green and a blue bot and the green bot always try to capture the pumpkin before you. You have to defend it. After you got the first pumpkin you have to yeah, develop your base as fast as possible and we will take a look what will happen here. So we got the first pumpkin. Now we spread out our army. Here we have the middle on this place also and also here on the right side pumpkins can appear. I have to spread my army out. The green bot is always in front of the blue player's base and will go to the pumpkin when it appears. Here and here in the green player space is a building when you destroy it a pumpkin will come out and you can collect it. So you can earn two pumpkins from these two buildings but it is very hard to get them and you have to be very fast. So rewash HQ level 3 for Hero Factory level 2 and for Mammoth Porcupine and Jaguars. So, I'm a little bit late here. It's better to stay here really in front of the blue player's base to always kill the green player's or green bot's army before he's jumping on a pumpkin because this will slow down your time. So we got the second one. You have to be also careful 
every pumpkin could be a bad or a good pumpkin, you never know. You never know. So, units come out and we try to go forward with our, well, we have a small army. We have to build up a lot of units fast. The next pumpkin is coming and we have not much units here in the middle. We are here too slow. But as I said, it's a review and not uh, how you take a metal uh, video here. But I can tell you how it works. So, he defended another pumpkin. Unfortunately, a green unit was on the pumpkin that slows down the capturing of the pumpkin. But we got it. The next pumpkin is ours. So, Mole is now in the middle. That's very good. And now I will produce my units and send them to the green player's base. You can see the green player's base have a shield on the buildings. That means that these buildings have a higher armor and HP. It needs much more time to destroy these buildings. It's very hard to come to the two pumpkins on the left and on the right corner. So, I am now in the perfect position. We can spread our army so they con can collect the pumpkins very easy while our army is fighting the green and blue bot. Always, when they're coming, they will get destroyed by our units. Perfect position here is to stay so with your army. And then you can focus also on the left and right corners. What is very important, you have to attack as soon as possible when you really want to fight for a medal. You see green bot is coming down and direct gets attacked from our armies before the pumpkin arrive. That means we can collect it without any problems. So, kill the bot's army. The next pumpkin appear and we are going to collect it. So, nothing crazy so far. We are defending the middle very well and now we can go to attack, well, as I said, the green bot space. And it's not easy, as you can see. Defended by very strong towers with more armor and HP and also a strong army. And wow, what we see here, a very big cyclone army. This is the reason why I built up some more porcupines as usual, because they very hurt. So, defending the middle very hard. And these are a lot of cyclones man. So the next pumpkin appear in the middle. And we are, I must say it, too slow as you can see. That's definitely the wrong tactic with the wrong units or we played too slow. But we did not bad for the first time. So, defending just the middle is easy, it's just hard when you really want to take a medal. The next pumpkin will be ours. So, we got the next one. Again, a good pumpkin or a pumpkin without any effect. <laughs> that can also happen sometimes. So. Killed some of this very strong rocket towers here. My partner is here with a Leviathan, with a Resp, and with Salamander. And I try to get the pumpkin out of the building from the green bot space. It's hard. Next pumpkin here. And now you should take the pumpkins out of the buildings. Because now we got 8 pumpkins from the middle and we just need these 2 pumpkins from the buildings to have a top time. I think something like 
11 minutes is the maximum what you can reach here. So, I got the building, but unfortunately a second army of a lot of cyclones appears on my side and also on the side of my partner. He lost all three heroes and he will lose the pumpkin. Good that I have a lot of units here and I try to collect it, but it's hard. It's very hard. It's not easy. I don't know how it is with the confederation, if there are dragonflies. <laughs> yeah. It's hard. The next pumpkin on the middle is there. And we are too late here to take a good time anymore. Well, I don't know if the cyclones always come out, but it's it's not easy. So at least we got it and won the battle. I hope you liked the video. Leave a subscribe and a like for me and we will see us soon for the next video. Bye guys.